Hello. Hey, what's up, you guys, and welcome back to my channel. Thanks a lot for watching. So I'm somehow excited and very jumpy today because I am filming my favorites and I don't know when was the last time I did my favorites. I'm very sorry guys but come to think of it I did not have a lot of new products uh, to show you so I would just be showing you the products that I showed you in my previous favorites but now I am so excited because I somehow have a lot of new products that I have been loving right now so before I have a very long intro let's just go on with the video First off is this MAC Prep and Prime Transparent Powder. I have a um, separate video that I would talk about this product in full. But I really, really love this product. All I can say is that this changed the way I do my face makeup. I think that my face makeup, when it comes to everyday makeup, it's it looks more natural right now. And it's as if um, I didn't put any makeup on my face. And I use it. This is another one of my favorites. I use it with a brush and this one is from Maria Nod. And this one is just a compact brush, a retractable brush just to put inside my kit. It's very fluffy but at the same time it has like its shape is somehow very kabuki like but at the same time somehow powder brush like it's like a hybrid of the two and it's very soft it glides on smoothly on your face and it distributes the product in a very somehow photogenic airbrushed effect the next one is an oldie but a goodie and i've had this product since forever and <laughs> this one is just a white eyeliner and this is from chanel and as you can see, it's very, <laughs> I've used this a lot. And I, I've been using this for like four or five years already. And as you can see, it, it's still going strong. And this is just a basic white eyeliner. Lately, I've been into makeup looks that is very brightening, wide-eyed, and I'm not really a fan of corally, somehow pinky, or bordering on the orange lipsticks, but I'm a changed person. I am now open to trying more lipstick colors like that, and this is the first lipstick that I tried that color with. And this one is from Etude House. Is that Etude Etude House? Not sure. Not sure. Um, but look at the packaging. It's so sweet. It's very girly. And this is um, the color right there. And I'll give you a swatchy swatch. There you go. It's somehow a corally pink with a hint of orange and I am wearing it right now and I noticed that using colors like this opens up your face. It's as if your face is already smiling even though you're not. Next one is also from the same brand and it's a brow pencil and it is double-ended. You have your product there and then you have a spoolie at the other side and I like these types of products because it's very easy to use. The shape of this eyebrow pencil really helps with your eyebrow application because it's already slanted like that. As you can see there's somehow a um, triangle there so that could be your guide for shaping your brows. Next is a blush and this is my favorite blush right now. Also, this is my favorite blush color right now and I'm wearing it on my cheeks. It is somehow a very dramatic color but I'm into those colors right now. But it is from Revlon and it is the Playful Plum Blush. 
there. And as you can see, the color is very scary because, whoa, that color is so dark. But I will tell you, it would look very natural. You just have to be careful with it. This is the color right here, there. And as you can see, it's very scary, just like what I said. But you could also shear it out. When you shear it out, it has a very natural effect. Like It's just like you just went out of a gym. You have that rosy glow. And the last one is a perfume. And this was actually a gift. And this is the Elizabeth Arden Green Tea um, what is this? Cherry Blossom. Yes, guys, you know that I have an addiction with green tea and my signature scent is just the original version of this Elizabeth Arden. But this one just smells somehow a bit more feminine but still clean at the same time. And I really like that smell. I would spray some to you guys. I hope you could smell. Oh, smell that fresh goodness with me. I'm going to give away the Etude House um, eyebrow pencil and the Etude House lip color. So if you want to win these products, of course, not these products. I would, I have new products to give to you. You just have to be a subscriber and that's it. If you are a subscriber, I would just randomly choose from all of my subscribers and you're already entered. So there will only be one winner. And if you are a minor, just tell your parents about this. Get your parents' permission because that would be weird if I would be sending you stuff and your parents might think that a stranger from the internet is sending you stuff. So just get your parents' permission. And as usual, this giveaway is open internationally. So you don't have to comment anything, you don't have to do anything, you just have to be a subscriber. So let's go on with my outro. So this is Tish and I'll just see you on my next video.